Okay, so hopefully you watched that other video on how to do this front view. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to project all these lines just like we did before. We're going to project them up and we're going to project them over to create the other views. Okay, so take our straight edge. Oh, wait, look, if you're using graph paper, your lines are already there. But just for practice, remember, we're going to do these super light so we can erase them later. That is way off. Okay, make sure you stay right on those grid lines. Again, not looking for perfection, just looking to um, have you try and learn, you know, something. Okay, so say we want to start the top view. Put it, I know, this focus is weird. All right. So we're gonna line up that grid line a projection line and that projection line. Can we see that? Oh, we can definitely see that. Okay. Now, here's the next part. To figure out that dimension, it's this. It's one and a half inches is the overall width. Okay. Again, if you have a ruler, you know, measure out an inch and a half. If you don't, just count the blocks. Okay, inch and a half on that one. And we have got... And again, these blocks are not perfect. But copiers do weird things. And then you're just going to connect it across. Okay, use the graph paper as guide. If you're using loose leaf or a blank sheet, you know, try your best. And we want to darken these ones in. Alright, because in the top view you will see those lines. Okay. And hopefully you all can hear me with this air circulator going on. Okay, so so far we're good. We have that coming up. We have a front view. We have a top view. Okay, the next step is going to be creating that right side view. Again, projection lines. If you're using graph paper, they're already there. You're going to take it from pretty much every corner on that block. Whoop! Even this one right there. Oh, that one was way off. Oh, wow. How did I even get a tech job? Because I know how to fix it. Okay. Alright, so, again, we're going to start right here, and we're just going to choose a line a little bit close to the edge to make this line right there. And this dimension right here, once again, is that inch and a half. Okay, so we measure inch and a half. Make sure it's nice and dark. These object lines have to be nice and dark. I have old eyes. Okay, then you just connect this down. And then connect this over. Okay, now, if you're looking at this block this way, you will see this line. So let's make sure we darken this one up but you won't see this line. So again, that's where our 
hidden line comes from. And I know it's really hard with this uh, dark graph paper. It'll make a nice dash line. Hopefully you can see that, that it's dashed. Okay, and that is all you need to do. Oh, almost forgot. Make it look nice, Mr. Travis. All right, want to erase our projection lines. Okay, so that's all you got to do. You're recreating, recreating these three views. Okay, that's all you got to do. That's it. Put your name on it, snap a picture, turn it in. All right, any questions, please reach out.